biggest challenge in today's world as a businessman is how do you retain your people? And only way is to share success. Whatever money I make, I invest back into future talent. One day I will retire, but then I'll own 10 new talents. Gagan has opened a restaurant called Meatlicious, which has got nothing to do with Gagan. And then Soaring is two chefs who wanted to do new German cuisine. And I thought they were a serious threat to my own restaurant. And I said, what you can't conquer, buy. The day my downfall starts and their peak starts, I'll at least be making money with them. Today, there's no Malaysian restaurant in the list. And I think that's not a problem of the list, but the problem of young Malaysian chefs who don't believe in their own cuisine. If I can talk to him for five minutes, go to that 80-year-old lady and take all her secrets back and make something out of it, something imaginative. And let the whole world travel just to Malaysia to eat your restaurant. I want to retire when I am at my top. I don't want to retire when I'm almost out of the list and I'm bored and people are bored of me. That doesn't mean I'm stopping to cook. I will be cooking. I will cook till I die.